Lion is Apple's most significant update to Mac OS X for years. Taking its cue from the iPhone and iPad, navigation now uses slick gestures. It's stable, feature-packed, and nothing short of a bargain. At PS20.99, OS X's seventh major release is cheaper, and likely more effective, than any other upgrade you could make to your Mac. With easier file sharing, improved backup, and greater use of iPad-like gestures, it's like getting a whole new Mac for less than the cost of some RAM. It's available now from the Mac App Store. Look and feel a knee. Where Lion's looks are concerned, little has changed beyond a new pop-up effect for dialog boxes and a squaring off of their buttons. The way you use your Mac, though, is significantly different, and for some it will take a little getting used to. Scrolling now works in reverse, so to move down your page you push up on the trackpad or mouse. Likewise, to see anything to the left of your current view, you swipe right. Scroll bars, too, have largely disappeared, fading into view as you scroll and disappearing again as you stop. Saves you from yourself. Autosave is now a core feature. Apple provides the hooks for developers to build it into their apps. So in the unlikely event your Mac crashes when you're using an enabled application, you shouldn't lose any data. Applied learning. Several headline apps have had subtle makeovers. iCal and Address Book now look far closer to their iPad equivalents and Safari has been refined, with downloads no longer spawning a floating window outside of the browser to track their progress. Instead, this information is hidden behind a button on the toolbar which, when clicked, calls up the familiar downloads window. Now within a bubble. Quiet revolution. Other changes are important, but less likely headline grabbers. AirDrop builds on the success of Bonjour. Apple Zero Config Networking Protocol, allowing Macs running Lion to see each other wirelessly, even if they're not connected through a router and for the user of one to drop files on another. This will be a boon for ad hoc working groups meeting in coffee shops or libraries. FaceTime, the iPhone video conferencing tool, has earned itself a place on the dock. Previously, it was a 69-up download from the App Store. About this Mac has a new, more graphical layout with direct links to disk utility, upgrade instructions, and the manual for your Mac on Apple.com, and a pane that checks whether your machine is eligible for service and repair. Overview We've been using Lion for several months through its development cycle and been consistently impressed by its stability and the speed at which it runs on a decidedly middling MacBook. Apple has clearly learned much from its experiences in developing iOS, and the features it has brought across to OS X are logical, genuine enhancements. We are going to end this video right away. If you have any query or information to share, please leave a comment below. Thanks for watching.